guys. This is for Brian and Aaron. This is some awesome bus food. We take these dehydrated mushrooms, a couple handfuls, and rehydrate them. The trick to this is you got to do this like an hour, at least an hour before you're going to cook them. Let those mushrooms rehydrate. Um, wait till you see what happens next. Okay, check it out. These babies are all rehydrated. And now you got this mushroom broth in there. And you take and you add precisely measured miso paste in there. I like this one. Bring it up to a boil. It's pretty complicated so far. Maybe a little bit more of that stuff. Mmm, got all these different styles of mushroom. Then, we take these. You're interfering with my cooking show. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I won't play anything. <laughs> Shelly's still feeling a little under the weather. Okay. Now we take the Udon noodles. And all we got to do is bring that to a boil. Boil it for a bit. Add these noodles. And if you want to, you can add the little flavor packet too. I usually throw it in there because why not? It came with it. Oh yeah, there we go. Boiling away. Might as well add in whatever, whatever that seasoning packet is, that noodles, which are pre-cooked. So all you got to do is get this hot. While that's getting hot, I'm going to dice these babies up. Okay, scallions to sprinkle on the top. Now, yeah, the noodles are breaking up because they're getting warmed up and loosened up. Just one final step to taste this. And then make this to your desired taste with some soy sauce. That's about it. Oh yeah, if, Shelly, if Shelly's involved, we'd have some shaved carrots in there, huh? Well, oh, yeah. Carrots and broccoli we can add in there. Well, dang it. Man, you made me feel bad. I gotta go prep some vegetables. Broccoli is in. That's just pretty uh, pretty uh, critical. <laughs> Gonna fix the carrot. So it's so easy. All you got to do is cook it until the vegetables are as tender as you like and get an even distribution because if Shelly gets shorted a few mushrooms or something, she is not happy. This takes one pan, one meal that was for one person and turns it into a very filling meal for two people. And it's so freaking delicious. Wow. We love it. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Little onions on the top. There you go. Smells so heavenly. It's ready to eat. Dinner, baby. Easy one pan. Besides soaking the mushrooms, it's like super efficient way to have an awesome good meal. This is comfort food right here, you guys. This gets the job done, huh? Yeah, and the wild mushrooms in here, oh my gosh, it just takes it over the over the top. Which, and those mushrooms are coming from Pistol River, which was 15 miles from where we used to live. Yeah, that's what's crazy, so. Super awesome. <laughs> this is, 
just what I needed, honey, to make me feel better. Thank you. Umami, baby, umami.